I'm the vice chairman of Pop Finance organisers of this conference. This last part has been designed by our uh, project officer Maxime de la Fosse, and I wanted to thank him for these, the idea of these organising these short speeches, which will uh, open our our minds, in a sense, to uh, the latest. Um, uh, uh, affairs in uh, finance. We're not uh, trying to look into the, a crystal ball and uh, see what's going on, but we're going to talk about the present and how things are changing and how uh, the world of tomorrow is being uh, reinvented, uh, both in terms of uh, finance and uh, financial engineering. So this idea of the present uh, continuous is an uh, idea from a philosopher called Henry Bergson is uh, very relevant to what's going on today. One person who would have uh, been very welcome at this finance fiction event, even though uh, she doesn't talk about exactly the same subject, is Sylvia Flory, who's just brought out a book which talks about the way things are moving forward today. Uh, based on civil society initiatives, some of which are big, some of which are small, and how uh, society is changing. These are the kind of challenges we want to talk about this evening. We're going to have uh, some successive talks, which are going to be very dense, uh, but hopefully uh, inspiring. François Morin, who is a professor of economics from the University of Toulouse, who is going to kick things off. Uh, and then, in no particular order, I think it's probably going to be Adrien Aumont. No, then it's going to be uh, Jérôme Kerviel, uh, who probably requires no introduction. He's not here to talk about his story that's been in the news, but he's going to uh, give us his vision, his point of view on what's going on in the world of finance. That's what we're interested in. Then we'll have either Adrien Aumont or Sam Raymond. Sam Raymond's already talked a fair bit today. Thank you very much to him for coming all the way from Washington. He works for the World Bank and is particularly interested in crowdfunding for the development of finance. So, uh, finally, Adrien Omar, who is the co-founder of Kiss Kiss Bank Bank, who, who has uh, a really clear vision over the about the future of finance. So, thank you to him for being a partner for this day. Then we will have... Uh, genuine fiction with a, a writer called Alan Damasio who's a, a fiction writer he said instead of we should have uh, we should have probably talked about fi finance science fiction he would have uh, uh, been in his element with that but in any case he's going to uh, open our minds to what is possible with his little fiction first of all Francois Morin Oh, and I forgot one thing. Uh, to kick off the session, we actually invited Michel Rocard, who wrote a letter, uh, uh, a letter asking the future generations uh, to forgive uh, the political generation for the failures of today, because he's a, uh, fairly elderly. We uh, instead of inviting him, we in interviewed him, uh, and we've got a short video with uh, Michel Rocard on this subject. The world of finance, as seen by Michel Rocard. Our world is uh, going badly. Uh, finance is going badly because finance has forgotten its uh, limitations. It's uh, for the needs for investment are no longer being uh, respected. When you talk about the private sector, uh, investment is uh, uh, focusing on uh, uh, financial activities rather than investment. Banks are financing less and less investment, so the amount that is going into investment is not significant enough to get keep the economy going around. The American Federal Bank did not uh, uh, dare to raise its interest rates recently because it is afraid of uh, this uh, purely speculative uh, finance system and this will uh, just uh, worsen things in general. The non-profit sector has not been sufficiently uh, supported, that's part of the crisis. 
in macroeconomics and particularly in finance, we can't find balance without ethics. We need to find a form of uh, wisdom or self-control within uh, the world of finance. It's very nice to uh, earn money when prices are going up, but that is not uh, usually the way that wealth is generated. So there needs to be a form of regulator. Uh, so good luck to you all with all of these uh, new techniques for funding collective uh, projects. Good luck. Good luck to you all. Voyage, Voyage into the Finance of the Future, presented by Alain Damasio, with Jerome Kerviel, former trader, François Marin, economist, Samuel Raymond from the World Bank, and Adrian Oman, founder of Kiss Kiss Bank Bank. We're still looking for the way forward.